that goes there occasionally. Like, there's there's a lot of Palutena, and you're seeing a lot of this Palutena as more and more players start to kind of be resolute in, yeah, this character's still good. I just got to be clean with it. Uh, shout out to Louis Money winning uh, Gateway Legends. Yeah, I'm, I'm a big fan of Team Fundies out here, especially between both of these characters, you know. But Fatal having a really good opener there, but hold on, this is the Palutena show here. We got the classic Nair to the back air, and maybe that ledge trapping in progress, but Fatal was able to just interrupt that flow for just a little second there with the hover. I mean, Ness is all about the counter hits, right? Like, I, as Ness, you want to be able to start things off of reversals oh. in many a times. So that up air isn't gonna do it, but will we see the chase from Mateo? Uh, not necessarily just waiting for the option to be selected from Fatal and then covering with that massive closing out up air. Yeah, you always have to be real careful, real picky with how you kind of just go in on your opponent when you're playing Ness, especially against Palutena, with who's just able to juggle you out, kind of wall you out. And once you get like tossed up in the air, it's like you're going to be holding like 40, 50% off several up airs. That I feel like is some, it's just such an important pivot. Like Palutena will go for like down throw forward airs or like Ooh. setups onto, uh, setups into a lot of her horizontal moves, forward airs and back airs and neutral airs especially. But Palutena down through on biplat stages especially sets up into up airs so, so well. But I love that up smash from Fatal. Run up, expect the block there from Mateo, and hold that up smash. Oh my Ooh. god! You got those? I guess, yo, that's why. That's why uh, Mateo's too clean. I see the tag. I, I see the vision, dog. Yeah, this is. We didn't even go. Uh, we went this entire time without bringing it up. Uh, this is one of the <laughs> original, like, Ness hard counters. Like, oh, you want to blow up Ness? Just play Palutena. This character's Always. like this character's faster, has a lot of solid air to airs, can blow up Struggle. this light character, can juggle in them forever. Look how active this up air is. It just doesn't stop. <laughs> Man, this is miserable right now. And see, almost able to get the two frame, but not quite. We have the 50-50 and you lost it. You, you lost picked it. heads and he got tails. Like, you know. Sometimes it be like that. And God. Damn. Especially, like, I really have been enjoying, and you see this with a lot of, like, uh, Peach down throw as well. There's a couple down throws that are starting to get a little bit more development. Um, in terms of just, like, okay, like, this down throw, even if it's not a raw combo tool anymore, and in the case of Palutena, where, like, you don't get down throw fair anymore, okay, I can get down throw into wait for my opponent to do something. Are you going to retreat? I take space. Are you going to attack me? I dash back forward smash. Yeah, and... One thing I like that Fatal kind of did in that set was like the pressure check with like the up smash of like, oh, do you know the knowledge check here of just like, are you going to jump out of shield? You like hold shield so you can kind of get out of it. But no, he hit it anyway. But Mateo has just been able to play to the win conditions of Palu so well, just able to get like very clean two, three piece combos and just especially these juggle strings. Fatal has just been unable to kind of come back to the ground every single time. But here's an opportunity kind of opening up at the center here. It's the it's the trick of Ness, right? And why this one of the reasons why this matchup's really tough. Oh, Ooh, the cleanest of wavelands with the double jump. I really liked that from Fatal, but no, no way. Shot. Oh my god. No <laughs> way. You know. Three thousand IQ. You got it. Three thousand IQ. I'm he's, not gonna. He, he's just too clean, bro. <laughs> we got you. Got one. I got one. <laughs> Everybody gets one. <laughs> no, that's, that, that is was so true. That is insanity. So true. Kind of matching fate. Oh. Fatal. Oh, hey, yo. Hey, yo. Oh, he passed the knowledge check. There we go. Yeah, you just got to angle your shield down, wait for it to deactivate. I enjoy how Fatal has been taking his time a little bit more. This back throw won't do it from center stage, though. Mateo able to get back. Air dash there as well. Was very nice. And able to combo into the explosive flame. Chase. Chase again. Oh, no. Not yeah. enough. We're all, we were almost in the cycle, and Fatal's going to be have to be real careful coming back here, especially with those PK Thunders, because Mateo might just whip out the F Smash again, push him with the Wind Box, but nope, going to be holding the Ness back air at ledge. That move hits so hard. It is primo Ness aerial, where this button goes oh. crazy, but so does Palutena down tilt at ledge, not because it hits hard, but because it sets up infinitely into that back air. Has to recover back, but gets Aww. another two frame into that back air. And what do you say here, Snivy? It's just like, it, rather rinse, repeat. It is just the rinse cycle. You just repeat it over and over again. It's literally I, spinning. I, I, I love to call like those little ledge traps. They're just Mario Party mini games of chance. Like, 
Are you gonna roll? You know, are you gonna get hit by the jump in option? It's just so good. And this pressure, the, I like the combo from the explosive flame, the neutral B, and just hanging around for that forward air. Mateo is definitely looking to end this from fatal right now. This is what happens when you let a character that is really fast and has a really good like general punish game play against a player who wants to be aggressive and has a really good flow, good flow chart. Fatal has been super, super uh, cautious oh. on their air dodge, instead trying to play around with a lot of like Ness's buttons out of hit stun. And that can be really good, but Mateo is just playing into the fact that Fatal hasn't been air dodging with a lot of just raw aggressive buttons and getting instantly into Fatal's face. Time and time again, these dash attacks, and granted, power dash attack's insane, but the theory oh, is absolutely there. And this forward air, yeah, that'll do it. Man. Mateo had like three kill setups oh, there. Just like the dash oh. attack, the Nair went into the up tilt, but Fatal fell out of it. Fatal was making a good effort at the end due to kind of Ness's uh, advantage state, which we really didn't get a chance to talk about since it was mostly Paulu kind of dominating a lot of yeah. time. But Ness is so good at just setting up for his combo game. His, is he giving him advice? He is giving him a Fatal frame one, unplugged, gave the fist bump, and it was like, hey, you got any tips, man? Or whatever Coach he Fatal, said. Bro. Yeah, I mean, shout out to Fate. That's Coach you know, Mateo, bro. <laughs> true, true. He was coaching, like, you said two players at the Arcadian mm. bouncing back and forth. Way to go, way to go, Mateo. And I think one of them was, I think one of them was Mr. Muggs, who got a super clean upset mm -hmm. over um, Eliakim. Oh, my God. That set was crazy. It's like, you know, Coach Mateo out These here. These mid-tiers are crazy out here. Krugbo? You knew about Krugbo. I knew about Krugbo, yeah. I, I, that was a first for me. <laughs> Krugbo for the past two, not to dwell on in the past, but Krugbo the past like couple Arcadians got top eight or even maybe got top four, but was never able to to overcome that final like that final hurdle. But, he, but he's getting close. Like Krugbo's Krug's K rule is insanity and I'm it so is scared. very <laughs> scary. <laughs> He's coming for the PR next. It's over. Like, you have Brujo in, like, New England. And True. you already know Bru Brujo will be farming some of them out there. You know, I still think back to that set against Mute Ace. Like, that was so good. The Brujo Ling set? The, the Brujo Mute Ace set at oh, Shine. It was, yes, it was. Oh, yeah. my God. Uh, shout out to Shine. That's coming up this summer. Shine. That's going to be a great event. That's going to be and a it's, good one. And it's the last Shine, too, that's which so is fun. very unfortunate. But also, got to gotta send it off with a bank. Got to send